Paris knew that a win could potentially see them move into second place, depending on the result of the Monaco-Nice match. Unai Emery's men had played out a disappointing draw at home with Monaco a week ago. The Parisians could count on their star striker Edinson Cavani with 21 goals already this season, as they travelled to Dijon, who had never beaten them in the league before. But it was Olivier Dalolio's team who threatened first after Levin Cruzawa lost the ball. Marvin Martin took on the shots, but Alphonse Areola was saved by his post, and Paris survived. At the half-hour mark, Paris scored their first of the evening after a lot of confusion inside the Dijon box. Lucas tried once, but his second attempt was the right one as he blasted in to give Paris the lead. Lucas is seventh of the season. The Parisians, however, were ahead for 90 seconds as Adrien Rabiot lost the ball cheaply and it was rifled in by Julio Tavares, also scoring his seventh goal in 20 appearances this year in the league. Cheaply lost by Rabiot and then Pierre Les Melu put it on a plate for Tavares. Ariola, no chance. Level at half-time, Dijon competing very well with Paris in the first 45 minutes. The Parisians, on the other hand, wasteful in the opening half. After a lacklustre second half, Paris took the lead from a corner. Thiago Martosheto was saved by Batis Rene, but Thiago Silva pounced to turn the ball into the net. Rene conceding his 35th goal in just 23 games. It's a fantastic save to start, but then the Brazilian captain just had to poke it home. The Parisians even added a third in the 88th minute. The goal was set up by the new Parisian recruits. Draxler, Benarfa and then Guedes with the shot, but ultimately flicked in by Cavani, his 22nd of the season and his 11th goal in the last 10 PSG matches. In the end, a comprehensive victory for the defending champions and an important one. They move up to second ahead of Nice on goal difference and just three points behind Monaco.